In this demonstration, we will show you the basics about the Dataverse, the ETL pipeline platform for large language models. We will show you how to use the Dataverse with the examples that is listed on our open source GitHub page. Before heading to the examples, get a glimpse of the system architecture. This Dataverse ETL pipeline is the interface and the users will going to interact with configurations. This is basically what users need to know. And voila, this pipeline will be built and run simple as that. We are now going to show you the examples of how the Dataverse works with the user-friendly interface. The first thing is how to use it. We need to prepare the configurations like here. The configuration is consistent with two things, the Spark settings and what data processors you want to use. You just need to simply, after that, instantiate the ETL pipeline and put the configurations on it. As a result, here we go as the data set is returned and you can see here. So the next thing is, how are you going to add your own custom data processor for your own? So let's say we're going to use the Hugging Face data set. Dataverse supports Hugging Face data sets by just mentioning here like this, very simple, the ARC challenges. So you check the data set and you found the kind of like this choice columns and you want to remove it. So how are you going to achieve this? So it's very simple. You just need to put you just need to like define your own custom data processor and remove it and put the decorator register ETL and that's done. Next, you just need to put it on your configurations and run the ETL pipeline as before. And as you can see, there's no choice columns anymore. So the last thing is, so how are you going to run this on AWC MR for scale? It's very simple. Just put the like you did it like this before and just put the EMR option as true and that's done.